So hey guys, so today what we're going to be doing is modifying my exhaust system. Uh, the reason why we're going to be doing that is two reasons. One, so I can disconnect it quick and remove it at the drag strip. So the current setup, you know, has this flange, right, with the three bolts on it. It's a pain in the butt to remove uh, from the exhaust system because there's just not a lot of room. You know, it takes a lot of time to put it up there and get it back out. The other problem I have is I've tried using aluminum gaskets and you can see it's not sealing up very well. I've also tried using, um, you know, the paper fil paper style or the uh, exhaust style, you know, those don't seal up very well. I had the same problem and I'm tearing them. So what I thought I'd do is put V-bands uh, onto the header and then also weld the other side of it onto this flange. And so that way, all I need to do is take basically the V-band loose, disconnect it from the front. I've got a, a simple two bolt setup in the back. So more or less, real quick, I can drop the exhaust system off and remove about 40 pounds from the, from the car. So that's what I'm gonna do. So I've already welded the V-bands onto the headers. I actually had done that before I started the channel. Um, so now what I'm gonna be doing is I need to cut this flange off here um, because as you can see what I need to do is weld the V-band on here and you saw I basically need to cut this flange down and so I can weld this side of the V-band on. And the nice thing is, as you can see real close, see how this one sticks out and you notice how this V-band you know, is inward so you've got a nice tight fit. Um, so that's why it works so well and it'll seal up. And then once you slip over the V-band, you can see, trying to do this with one hand is kind of hard. Anyway, you'll see basically I got to do is the V-band will clamp onto this real nice and tight. Um, you know, and basically I can tighten it up with this nut and then I can double nut it or I can tighten it up with that nut. I can double nut it to make sure it doesn't come loose. So that's the purpose of going with this V-band setup. So no more exhaust leaks, quick on and off. You know, like I said, I've got two bolts in the back and I can drop this. Uh, my exhaust system here, you can see is long. Um, it weighs about 40 to 45 pounds total. So that'll help uh, with weight reduction and you know, my ETs, um, as well as get rid of some of the back pressure from the headers. So that's what I'm gonna do. Now, the reason I need to make sure what I'm gonna do is I'm only going to take this, I'm gonna set this on there, and then I'm gonna put the exhaust on, and then I'm gonna tack this on while it's in the car or under the car. Um, that way, you know, I wanna make sure I've got a good, nice seal to the opposite piece. Uh, so like I said, I've already got these welded onto the header. I want to tack these onto this once I get this flange removed, and then I'll set it up under the car and make sure that's a good, nice flush, flush fit, and then I'll do the finish welding. So with that said, let me go ahead and start modifying this flange so we can do the next steps.
so for my rear exhaust hanger, what I did is I bought these, I don't remember if it was off Amazon or eBay, but basically this is a rubber bushing inside this metal bracket here, and then it came down with this metal rod. What I did is took this two and a half inch exhaust clamp and welded it to the side of this rod. And then basically I just have the two nuts to tighten the uh, back of the exhaust um, to it. So that way it's real easy. So basically all I need to do is drop the V-band up front, come to the back, take these two nuts out, um, or I could try to slide this out of the rubber and I can remove the exhaust quick and easy. So I just wanted to show you what my rear exhaust hanger looks like. So if you wanted to do something similar, you could to remove your exhaust real fast in the back. Hey guys, so I hope you liked that little video on why I went with V-bands on my exhaust system. Uh, you can see, you know, I was able to get rid of um, the blowout from the, the aluminum gaskets or the regular gaskets. It'll be a whole lot easier to drop the exhaust if I want to at the racetrack. Um, you know, it's also much cleaner, much easier to just, if I have to do any maintenance to the car and have to remove the exhaust for whatever reason. So uh, I'm really happy the way the V-bands turned out. So uh, I hope you liked the video. Uh, please feel free to leave comments, you know, and as they say, like, subscribe, hit the little bell for future content. And I really appreciate you guys taking the time to watch this video. So with that said, get out in your shop and fabricate something. Take care, guys.